Mm -hmm. Hi, everybody. So this is Best Branding Solutions here. My name's Tara. I wanted to take a moment today and switch up topics a little bit and uh, talk to my friend Lillian McGuire. Uh, Lillian, as you see, <laughs> very talented writer and blogger. Um, and she's going to talk a little bit about uh, some of her favorite things to write about. Lillian, what are your favorite things to write about these days? I love to write about anything that is going to help someone achieve their goals or uh, achieve a better daily life. So uh, my niche is lifestyle and health. So I'm really passionate about, you know, well, how can we troubleshoot things? How can I inform someone else about how to enhance their life? make it better so we can all get closer to, you know, the goal that we all have is to be happiest that we can be and thrive, right? So that's what I really like is to write about things that are genuinely going to help people. Right. I love that. Something that has value. Right. So true. Yeah, um, yeah, exactly. And everybody needs to hear that kind of stuff right now, right? And, you know, it's, it's uh, you know, there's major things happening out there in the world and in our country. Um, there's a lot of upheaval, um, but I think there's still plenty of room for positivity, and that's definitely why I wanted to talk to you today, because I, I kind of came to the revelation this year that um, we have all the power, and by we, I mean individuals. I have all the power in my situations, you as well, um, but it, it kind of, it's mm -hmm. like, it's like the big three, if you will. It's, it's thought, and then it's affirmation, and then it's manifestation. Um, when you have that positive mindset that what I like to call like an abundance mindset, you don't have scarcity. It's not possible because you have such abundance in mindset. Um, mm -hmm. because you won't accept less than what you deserve or you won't be put in potentially, you know, situations that don't favor you. Um, but it all kind of starts with the thought, do you th don't you think? Yeah, definitely. And uh, how passionate you are about that thought. So, you know, if you're kind of half and half on the fence, it's not going to work, right? Because you have to be all in. You have to have the passion and the drive to really go through those three things in order for what your idea is to, to really work. Because if you're not all in, it's, you're, the man, the, you're not going to get to manifestation because you're not going to do the proper steps to even get to that point. So it's not... It's not even worth it. I That's think. right. Yeah. yeah. I, I hear that. And it's and that man or that, you know, it's that affirmation part right there in the middle. It's kind of it's kind of like in the middle of that sandwich. Um, yes. <laughs> you know, it's, that's how I kind yes. of it. But you have to say it out loud. You have to, you know, wake up with the thought every day that you're going to achieve that goal and then positively then affirm that thought and speak it into existence. Right. Right. Yeah, definitely. And, and something that I think about often, it, you know, when I have thoughts of, oh, am I, am I doing this right? You know, am I doing the right thing? Am I doing actually what I want to do? I, I take a step back and I say, all right, have I done, have I taken all of the steps? Am I doing everything that I can possibly do to achieve what I want to achieve? And if the answer is yes, then there you go. You know, you're on the right track. You're doing what you need to do. But as long as you take those steps and affirm, like you said, positive mm -hmm. and believe that you can do it, it's a done deal. It's a done deal. That's right. It, it becomes a physical manifestation of a reality that you've created. And, yes. you know, once you come to that realization that it's all in your court, the ball's right there in your court, it's under your control. It's the choices that you make actively every day that will then create that reality mm -hmm. to manifest. And it's with anything. It's, you know, success. If you want to be the best mom in the world, what do you have to do? You have to think positively. You have to affirm that, yes, you're the best mother. Yeah. And then manifest. it manifests, <laughs> right? I mean, it's whatever your goal is. Yeah. 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 It's, it's fun. Yeah. I love it. <laughs> I know, I know. I am the best mom. <laughs> I'm the best, best mom. mom. That's right. That's right. It takes. Oh. Hey, they say it takes a village, but it also takes a lot of uh, <laughs> a lot of yeah, self talk, definitely. right? A lot of yeah. self talk. That's right. right. Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, that's, that's great, Lily, and I I really appreciate you 
stopping by today uh, on this little call and it was so much fun and guys take the time check out Lillian's work she's a fantastic writer she's a fantastic blogger um, mm -hmm. one of the things that I see Lillian doing and you know maybe Lillian you have maybe you haven't thought of this or maybe you've thought about it maybe it's a goal but <laughs> gosh you know in corporate culture in America today especially um, it's one of the most important things is to really attract good employees and to also um, have a really strong corporate culture because that's that's a part of your brand that's a part of your message is that corporate culture mm -hmm. and having somebody that is um, a fantastic writer and blogger that can help write positive affirming messages uh, you know even in internal corporate communications uh, or messages to external clients in business it's so needed in the corporate world right now uh, that we have that po positivity and that uh, you know just express positive messages. I think I think you would be oh my gosh you'd be a perfect person for that right? <laughs> Definitely. Oh yes. Yeah. Let's speak for it sure. into existence. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I love it. Well, Lillian, it was so great talking to you. Can you give your uh, contact info for our audience, please? Yes, you can uh, find me on Facebook at Lillian W. McGuire on my business page. You can follow me on Instagram at Lillian.W.McGuire as well. And you can also check out my website at www, wait for it, www.LillianWMcGuire.com. Nice. I love it. Yep. Um, but thank you so much. And I will throw up your contact info um, with this video as well. But I appreciate it, guys. And um, look for some exciting content to come for from Lily and McGuire. Talk to you soon. Thanks for having me.